All right, frigid, freezing, numbing. There's so many ways we can describe today's cold, Marty. I'm sure you have a few more that you can add to that list there. Setting up for some potentially nasty winter weather. Your first alert weather team has you covered. Marty Bass is here to break it all down for us. Hey, Marty. Well, hey, Kelsey. Thank you very much. Good evening, everyone. How are you? Let's go ahead and break down to you. And we're starting to see this winter weather event, which, by the way, is really going to take on here in the mid Atlantic a nor'easter type of feel, if you will. If you've just moved to the area, yeah, there are snowstorms, but you get these big lows rolling up the coast, and we're going to call those nor'easters. And you can get nor'easters without snow that are worse than, the, than a big winter weather hit that you'd find out west of the mountain. So we're going to be talking this nor'easter. Snow, some heavy. There will be a period of icing. We are going to see heavy rain. Gusty winds. Winds going to be an issue for a couple of days, by the way. You can have a little minor flooding because water is going to pile up on either shore of the bay as the low moves through and then on up to the northeast. Monday, there could be a little freeze up on roads. We are going to see a change over to rain, but this day's coldest, Kelsey and Tone, meant business. That ground is freezing, and that's where you get freezing rain. Remember, freezing rain falls as wet ice is on contact. So, Maybe a freeze up, some lingering snow showers, gusty winds, there could be some coastal flooding as that low nor'easter goes roaring itself right up the coast. These are alerts that will go into effect through tomorrow. Uh, uh, warnings and advisories. Notice the warnings are out to the west. And once again, I'm going to spin a positive on this for Western Maryland. The ski industry, which is a very big deal in those counties, has been begging for some real falling from the sky snow. For a couple of years, there'll be a lot of people who love to ski calling in sick over the next two or three days to get out to those slopes. Okay, fine. Advisory in effect, Central Maryland, and none as we move on down Route 50 quarter toward the eastern shore. Here's how it squares away. Plowable snow, Frederick West. Messy. Here in Central Maryland, a burst of snow, period of icing, change over to rain with its own maybe problems Monday morning. Limited mixing, heavy rain as you move off to the south and east. Here's how it squares away. Frederick and West, 6 to 12. Frederick and to Baltimore, call it six, then to three, okay? Then from Baltimore and on toward Easton, uh, Cambridge, uh, make it three to maybe a coating, mainly rain. And this is before in central Maryland, rain starts washing that snow away. Here's our Barron's model future cast. I want you to note by 3 p.m. tomorrow, 2, 3 o'clock, here comes that first burst of snow. Then we start to see a mix moving our way as we get into the bedtime hours. Then overnight, we continue seeing that mix to rain. And then Monday morning, gone. But there'll be wind in the area, maybe some freezing rain. So uh, just once the, the model clears, doesn't necessarily mean the issue is over. 24 degrees right now. Overnight, we're going to single digits to about 12 degrees with cloudy skies. Wind chills tomorrow, a whole lot gentler than they were today. That is for sure. An alert day tomorrow, an alert day on Monday. Uh, stay very weather aware. 34 then to 40, almost 40. Look at that, 47, three shy of 40. Boom, temperatures fall again Friday and Saturday. Let me throw it back to you.